Generic greetings and welcome back once again to Academia Skill Simulator where, as you can see, we have found some people that were up to no good. In this particular case, it says, whoops, got caught. So what exactly were they caught for? Smoker, rebellious, near sighted. So yes, they're being um, shouted at because they were smoking in the toilets. Let me just double check then our reports and we can see from delinquency that yes, we have two bullies, one truant and two smokers. So actually, there's been a... a very steep increase in that, which is interesting but not welcomed. Anyway, in the previous episode, we actually got quite a lot done considering the time we spent on things. We went over and built the library on the left hand side here, which is, seems to be working quite well. We then went ahead and changed up the staff and faculty lounges so we actually have them, uh, whereas previously we didn't. I don't know what bonuses this has, if any, other than well, maybe you just have to. Maybe you just have to have them, although mm, we didn't last time, but anyway. Uh, we then went ahead and built a swimming pool, of all things, because we knew we wanted to expand the common area because it was far too small, and we did that by placing up here, which we still need to put the flooring in and such. But we thought, yeah, the swimming pool, will it fitted in quite nicely. We had the ground for it, so we went ahead and got that. So it looks like... Uh, day 9, last day of the school year. Hopefully then, once we are finished, we'll be able to start the next day and make sure we've got more students, which means more money, which means not going bankrupt. So let's just see how we get on there. You have a rude student. Let's see. Let's see this rude student. And good grief. So, yeah. Darnell Gucci. Gucci. Can't really pronounce that. Uh, bully, caring, and flat earther. Hmm. Ironic that science is not their lowest thing then. Right. Anyway, so that's now sorted. Uh, we can see we do have the we do have an additional monitor, so that should make the place feel safe. And we did get another janitor. The problem with that is, well, this is the problem. Oh, and here we go. We can see the students are now swimming. And because of the size of it, they swim to the end and then get out and go through the wall. <laughs> okay. Well, that is different. So the teacher is telling them to swim. They jump in the water. Strangely, they don't get changed either. They're still... Yeah, I think we mentioned that before with the field and the running around. Um, they, just jump straight, they just jump straight in the water, swim... And then, because where they get out, they get out on the edge and then they have to <laughs> go through the wall. But then they're inside the male toilet. So then have to go... <laughs> it gets funnier every time you watch it. Um, they have to then go around. Right, that's a problem. That's a massive problem. Because I can't... I don't think I can do anything to fix it. <laughs> it means I have to move the wall, obviously. But we can't really do that. We can't, we can't move, shrink this down, really. Without altering the entire toilet. What we're probably going to have to do is put up and shut up for the for a little while. <laughs> or we'll just, you know, take the rough with the smooth and just take it. Just just say, look, it's funny. We're, we're fine. And where's that student off to? Going home. Oh! Because we have all of these students that are ill. Why is there a lot of, a lot of illness about? A total of five students ill. We could have... We could have treated them here because one two three four five hmm not too sure either way um going back to the swimming pool yes we will probably most likely definitely leave it for the time being because we don't have enough money to fix it what i'll have to do is go there oh there's a bullying incident where whoops got caught well good glad they got caught you see that it speeds up for some reason when when we click on them normal speed click on them Hang on. Click on them, and then it goes to max speed. I don't know why that is the case. Bully caring flat earther, yeah. So there, Daniel's gonna get taken to the principal office and uh, get. No, oh, there you go again. Smoke has been caught. Are they in the same thing? Bully judgmental and army brat. And who was the other one? Oh, I don't know. Krista Bollen dropped out because your school is filthy. Hmm. We're probably going to have to set some patrol routes. Let me double check then. Reports. Yeah. Still got three. Okay. It's 
it's not actually as dirty as it's been, which is the strange thing. But we have increased the size of the thingy. And because the this is the the ground, I think that's classed as dirty because of the common area. So we do need to put the flooring in sooner rather than later. The problem is that basically we don't have the cash. We do not have the cash. So we'll just have to see. It is fifth period, so obviously you can eat. I wonder if we can alter. Hmm. And another person dropped off because they're filthy. It's that. I think that's the one that's causing it. And that's going to have this This negative is still going to go up and up. Right, okay. Let me check out the department. No, not departments. Reports cafeteria. Dead usage is good. Okay. What's the option then? Zones. Edit zone. Inferior food for today. <laughs> um, yeah. Yeah, I guess so. Oh, did that tell me the capacity there? Oops, that's bad. That's that's the zone removed. Pause. Let's, uh, yeah, let's, let's, let's put that back in, shall we? Cafeteria. Done. Edit zone. Daily usage, 121. Well, the report... Oh, 121. That's fine. I was going to say, some, someone who's doing the reports is lying to me. Anyway. So, we've got the classrooms expanded. That's cafeteria income. Uh, are we getting con con uh, income from this? And again, they're just dropping out because the school's filthy. Mark Ula. Uh, I don't know what the solution is. I'm certainly going to have to maybe get rid of some of these staff. Certainly maybe, perhaps? <laughs> hmm, I don't know what the solution is. Apart from just close off the common area. Staff only. But even then, I think it just I, I think it just counts as a, like it's just a global thing. So I'm not too sure. Either way... Yeah, loads of people are leaving to go to the rival school. Hopefully... Once we get our intake, we'll be able to save it. You can see the classrooms now starting to empty up a bit. Yeah, this is bad. I don't know what the solution is, because I can't afford to fix the stuff there. So we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. And they're all trying to go in there, and we've said no. We, we've made it staff only. So they're going to have to go elsewhere. And I can't fix it anyway because I can't even get to the door now. <laughs> I can't even open the door if I wanted to. So, yeah. We're trying to get access to that. I wonder what bad thing... It's making the funds going down. Yeah. But they're now leaving anyway, so it doesn't matter. So we'll say that's now all. There's the dismissal. And that is... Oh, is that the last... No, it's day eight. We've got one more left to go. Uh-oh. That's bad. I don't know if we can do another day like that. I can't get another bank loan and I can't pay the bank loan back. Hmm. And we already have a grant. So, let's see what this is like. I think what we're going to do to save face and save the just save the entire place, really. Fire. A couple of the building staff. Fire a monitor. And I'm not going to fire the... I'm not going to fire anyone else. Warning, your funds are running low. Yes, I am very much aware. I don't want to fire anyone else. Janitor-wise, janitor anyway, because... Well, that would be quite bad. I'm going to sell the swimming pool and sell all of this stuff here because, quite frankly, we're going to have to move it anyway. So at least getting rid of that will give us some funds. So we're going to sell water back to <laughs> whoever. Um, I mean, this is something I didn't expect. You have a rude student. And also an invisible one, too. Oh, there we are. They've been taken there. So they've been told off. 
And I don't know why this game speeds up like that when you click on it. Scolded. One times, minus five motivation. Looking at the students though, going around each one, you can see like their you can see their rating. I mean I don't know if that you know, I don't know if you have to get to hundred. I guess it doesn't I guess it's probably not the case, but getting it there seems alright. I mean for the most part I would like to think we have done okay. What can I build? Can I actually build the wooden flooring in there? How much would it cost? More than we have, so no, we cannot. And I don't think we can sell the flooring in here, can we? No. No, you cannot. Literally selling flooring. Is that what it's come to? Really? Is that what it's come to? Uh, <laughs> I think it might have come to that, yes. Don't really want to get rid of anything else. Oh. That's wrong, some still demolish. How much of these? 33 per day for the sinks. Let's get rid of a couple of those. We don't have the need for that. I know there's been some advice given saying that we should go for this stuff for the water pump and uh, the wind turbines and stuff because if you get wind turbine and sell back the grid it's basically unlimited funds. <laughs> so yeah perhaps we might do that. Who's that student there? Recovering from sickness. Oh, at least they are, have been treated though. That's the, that is the main thing. Let's go ahead and... Negatives have gone right down. Wood panel floor. Yes, funds are running low, but getting that in means it hopefully won't be classed as dirty. This one. No, school is filthy, it says. Let's change that to staff only so they don't have access to it. And there's loads of rival schools. And oh, that's more negative than we've got. I don't know when it ticks over, though. I don't know when it ticks over. Do I want to get rid of these? Get rid of those for now. Just going to give more water costs. And there's, there's loads of stuff elsewhere. How many people are we at? We're at 48. So we start with 60. Hmm. Well, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. 8th period, 3 a.m. There's loads of people going to rival school. Once we get the next intake, hopefully it'll be alright. Up until now, though, we've done alright. It's just this section. I mean, writing's on the wall for a failing school, and we are certainly it. But hopefully now that we've got this flooring in, it's not going to be classed as filthy. Let me check the reports. And sanitation. It's not... I mean, there's a little bit of litter and some dirt, but there's no food, no cigarette, but certainly no feces and trash, trash bags and stuff, so... I think it's just... I'm guessing it's that. I could be guessing wrong, but there you go. It's in. Somewhat... Ironically, we moved it over here because we needed the extra space, but now that the students have left, not so much anymore. <laughs> but that is the end of the last school day. All the staff are leaving, and we'll now get a grading. I'm not anticipating greatness. Certainly not. But, final exams are currently ongoing. Continue. So, Lauren Ripsum Generi, teaching facility. This year's school rank, 846 of 1,000. We went up in the school rankings, good job. Well, we didn't have a rank anyway, as far as I'm aware. So, we now have a rating. Continue. You have a rival school in town, which everyone hates. See if you can beat your rival school in the rankings and show them who's the best. Okay. Passing rate, grade C. Prestige has gone up. Cash. Oh, we get cash for it. Oh, now I have a motivation. Um, <laughs> cleanliness, grade A. And, <laughs> hang on. No. Because people are leaving because it's... De you know, I'm not going to argue with it. You know, I'll take that. I'll take that. Uh, 30 prestige and 1,500 uh, generic goods currency on that one. Delinquency C, uh, plus 10 prestige, plus 500 for cash. And then a graduate pedigree A. 50 prestige plus 3,000. Total rank is B. 100 prestige and 5,500 generic units of currency. We have beaten many, many schools, including uh, Boone Valley Falls, Huang Valley Falls, James Lake, Grover Spring Falls, and lots of springs and hills and country and valleys. And there you are. Okay, so timeline. Let's have a quick look. Passing rate. 
All right, failed and only one, uh, one failed, one, a uh, couple, oh. yeah, drop out year one, 27%, that's terrible. Funds, bad. Rank, rivals gone up, a lot more. Population, students, teachers, and yeah, you can see we're maxed out there. So that's, I mean, there's not much to look at because it's just in the year. Exam results. So, those have dropped out and, and expelled. We've expelled none. So, 13 dropped out. None failed. And 47 passed. And we can see all there. What the pass. So, a couple of them have failed something. So, for example, Rosina here. Failed history. But they did pass the rest of it. Wow. 100% pass rate. Excellent. And then dropped out. So, exam... Evaluation grade, 78%. Freshman, 100%. Pass, which is excellent. Can't get better than that. Sophomore, 13, 87%. Junior, terrible, it's 6. Pass, t uh, 9 failed, 40%. Senior, 13, pass, 2 failed, 87%. Total, 78%. I'll take that, I'll take that. So, and now in the build phase. Yes, yes I am. Admissions, max it, and seats 24, and returning zero, so that's maxed, right, and we're resuming, hmm, don't get that, why is that in red? Is it just saying you've maxed it out? I think it is. Anyway, also we're going to continue on. And so we've got returning 15 from sophomore, which I guess were freshmen previously. And then we're going to bring in loads more junior because there was loads left. And then some senior up to the 24. And there you go. 96 seats, 96 total. That's our intake. So we have a little bit of money in order to build the rest. So, do we want to build anything while we're, while we've got the money? Yes, we do want to get this grant done, which is the research vice principles. It's six grand. The problem being, I don't have the funds. I can research vice principles. We'll start researching that. And quite frankly, we're starting the school year. We have no other option. So, there's our money as well, so we've got good cash flow. Immediately what we'll do is we'll build on this side. So, building over to... Actually, you know what I might do? I might finish the flooring in here. There. And then put the flooring in here. Because I think this could be the whole dirty thing. Faculty lounge, wooden floor. I know it's money, but I need to spend it. But we are getting five grand anyway, just because of the amount of students we've got. But we probably need to hire some more staff too. Because we've got more people. And I'm going to edit the kitchen back to what it was. Edit zone, that. Standard food per day. Not the... Not the... Cardboard that we were serving previously. We don't need to hire any more class... Uh, any more teachers, rather, for the classrooms. Don't, know any more, don't want any more nurses. I do want another monitor, though. And I think I probably need another cook. But I'll see what I can do. I'll see what I can do. Let's go over to building and then to the walls. Over to the stone wall. And we are once again going to be building on this side. And this will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And that's going to be a principal's office. And we'll move the principal over to there. And then that will be a vice principal. So, yeah, we'll do that. And that will be another grant done. Excellent. So doors, door, door, and demolish that wall. Obviously, they're finishing the rest off first. So there are all of our students. Our new, some for the most part, anyway. Actually, no, not for the most part. Some of them are. Obviously, the freshmen. And, ah, oh, playing with the Walkman. Other. Other non-branded generic music playing portable devices are available, but it's a Walkman. 
Um, and oh, look at that. Army Brat, Smoker, Lonely, and oh, they've been caught. At least the monitors go st straight away. They're like, nope, I know what's going on in there. <laughs> and ah, we now have broken things. So this is where, because it's the second year, it's introducing more challenges. So we've got things that are breaking. So we'll have to put more people on on that sort of thing. And is that door? Oh no, they haven't. They haven't placed that. That's all. Right. Okay. Fine. So they're cracking on there. We'll check out food. And as you can see, all of these classrooms are maxed out now. Excellent. And just hoping that the students do all right. There'll be a lot more dirt. Probably too. Uh, probably too early to check reports, but you know what? I'm not gonna I'm not gonna take any risks. Another janitor. And then I might and th I'll think about setting patrol routes up, but I haven't yet decided exactly what we're gonna do there. So this is obviously first first year over, so this is our second year and we will have to still keep an eye on things. And there's a rude student. And bully, confident, and bookworm. So they're going to go to the principal's office, and the principal will shout at them, or whatever they do. I don't know. I don't know what things they have in in, uh, in mind there. So this is going to be an office. So office, place that in there. I'm going to remove that zone for now. I'm going to sell that. And research has been blocked because we haven't done a office that is fine but we'll finish this off so down to here over to office we're going to place in the admin table packs machine filing cabinet and pet we'll place in the pet ball in that corner and there's a bullying incident there sadly that's gonna change to oh, that's gonna be on all so that's fine so that is the principal's office let's go ahead and go to building all we want wooden floor in there, wooden floor there, and oh, I didn't realise it's like flower planters and stuff. That's really nice. We're gonna place some, we're gonna place some of them at some point, and then finally the concrete along to there, and then this one is gonna be placed in off, back as an office. That'll be the vice principal when we get them, but they're not yet unlocked. Funds are going down, and wow, this it's a. Uh, Surprising just how many delinquents we have. Let's have a look. Reports. Delinquency. Ten delinquent students. No rowdy students. Four bullies, one truant, and five smokers. So definitely building this vice principal office and such is, I think, the way to go. So staff. Almost there. Take over. Vice principal. Oh, five grand. We haven't got five grand. Right. Build an office assigned to a vice principal, hire a vice principal. Oh, and we've got food fight. So, food fight. Looks like they've stopped. Looks like the janitor's going around to clean that up. Let's have a check that. What's our bank loan? Reports. Sanitation. Oh, very dirty. Right, we need, we need more. We need more janitors. There we go. Didn't think we'd need a lot more janitors, but we do. And also, things are breaking. Things are breaking all over the place. We can set up patrol routes to fix this, which I think we will have to do. But, for the time being, we'll be alright. We've got... Truants being caught. Whoops, got caught. Hmm. What we'll do is we will most likely wait until the next day, get the funds, and then hire that vice principal that'll give us the grant that'll finish that grant off which is four grand advance payment anyway so that's fine but it shows you just how much money you can lose and how bad things can come I and mean, look how dirty this place is wow i think we need another i would say another another janitor at least i mean we've already got five <laughs> And obviously hide an extra additional monitor. I reckon an additional janitor and additional monitor and then perhaps put them on patrol. But I don't know, I'm not too sure. You can see they're going and putting stuff in the bins, they're going to empty the bins. We need to increase the size of well we need to We need to set up the toilets because we need to put more stuff in. And obviously work on the swimming pool because we don't have one now. 
<laughs> I wasn't going to remove it, but when they were going through the wall, that was just hilarious. But yeah, having to shift it was, well, needs must. So, their rank, Rival, is 696 out of 1,000. We're 846, but better than what I did previously, which was like 913 or something like that. So yeah, so now that it's dismissal, I want to just pause the game a sec, check reports, sanitation, loads of dirt, bit of litter, a couple of trash bags, so yeah, they'll obviously clean it now, they're going around too clean, because there's loads of trash, so they're cleaning all that up. So I have no doubt that it'll be cleaned up, it's just, you know, how long will it take, although no, they are actually, right now they're, they're just leaving, aren't they? Yeah, I think they're just leaving. So an additional... Cleaner, janitor, certainly, is the way forward. Daily cash flow is 4,503 4, per day, but I don't know when that gets paid. Sooner rather than later would be nice. There it is, that's just gone in. So, staff, the bullying incident, there's no one here. Oh, they're on the way to school. So, we'll get the vice principal, and there we go. So, there's that grant done. Excellent. Obviously, that's going to reduce our cash flow, but that's not a big problem. Hire another janitor. Make sure this place is clean. So, we also want, then... Oh, we've got staff toilets, apparently. And set them straight, which is research counselling. Build an office to assign to a counsellor and hire a counsellor. Sustainable water. That's research pump. Full court press. Students are demanding a basketball court. That would be nice, but I'll have to rebuild this first. <laughs> and... Student transportation. Discovering history. That's an AV room. Hmm. Counselling. Can we get counselling? Let's have a quick look. Janitor priority in microfiber mops. I would like that. And even faster janitors and such. All this would be good. Alright, so where are we at? Anyway, going down... Teachers training, staff only facilities. Don't want those. Hmm. Don't know where. Car oh, counselling six grand. And what do you get for doing it? Ten grand. If let's build that because then we can put a counselling bit there because that's where I was going to go anywhere. Right. So I think we will leave it there. Um, we're in a better state than we were at the start of the episode, but still not in a fantastic state. We still have a lot of these bullying incidents, so we need to sort that out. We do have the problem with things breaking, so I do need to set priorities for people patrolling to repair things. And to be fair, that is... where would that be? We have monitor routing, but we don't have worker routing. Worker routing is there, which is... yeah. We've got worker priority, power tools... And then that, so that's going to be four, five, six and a half grand. Ouch. So, counselling first over here, and then we'll see about that other stuff. We also need to, as I said, expand the toilet facilities, because we did remove some of the stuff, so we'll sort that out. And put the swimming pool back in, but that will require alterations made on the field. But we can do that, that's quite an easy task. In fact, we'll probably do that sooner rather than later. Let me just double check swimming pool. We'll probably put the swimming pool in sooner rather than... Yeah. Get counselling done, then put the swimming pool in. I think that is the plan. That's the order of the day. Either way, we'll see how we get on. As always, if you have enjoyed the video on the series this far, comments in the comments. Thanks very much for watching. Take care, and generic partings.